Hmm, what's this? Hello, welcome back to The Freak Show. Pumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Disgaea PC. This is episode 4. They seem to have fixed the game finally, guys and gals. Before, I'll explain what happened later I, when we get into a battle. I don't know what I did or didn't do. Looks like we can treat Butch. And I believe we were a little bit short on experience for... You... Yeah, we want to get at least 10 for Laharl before we get another person. We can get one for Etna, though. Uh, you know what? I'm okay with that, I think. I think I'm going to go with Etna getting a new character. I think I'm going to be her new character. And that's going to be my thing. I think I'm going to become the one. Maybe. Alright, let's take a look. Um... So, so how does it, so it's the male, female, male, female. Okay. That's, that's interesting. Alright, I'm, I'm okay with that. Alright, I believe I'm going to become this guy right here. This is going to be me. I'm going to be a warrior. I'm good for nothing. No, I'm incompetent. That's how I roll. We're going to go with Bumpy being the guy. If you guys want, you can throw suggestions. I know my boy Antros, uh, the uh, whole reason we're able to play this, he said he wanted to be a brawler, so I'm going to wait until Laharl has the mana, and then I'm going to make him a brawler. So hopefully by the end of the episode it will happen. But for now, I'm Bumpy. Alright, so that's fine. I think I'm going to go with attack. And that is going to be that. And I am good with swords and axes. I think I might go with the sword this time around. For me. Now, I know I personally prefer axes, but I think Laharl's already rocking the axe. Let's see what kind of equipment we have here. Um, pretty sure I got some decent equipment for... Hmm. Alright, where am I? I'm going to change the order, too. I don't like having all the printies so far down. Well, this is a pretty crappy... You know what? We have we have enough. We'll, we'll get some stuff. It's fine. Alright, I'll throw that into the mix. And what we're going to do is come over here. You're the weapon person, right? Yes, the weapon shop. Let me buy this sword of doom. Alright, so every time you go to the shop, guys and gals, even if you just leave and immediately come back, uh, it changes. This is actually really good. I want this sword. Alright. So there we have it, and let's actually equip it, shall we? There I am at the bottom. I'm pretty sure I'm male. I'm not 100% sure that I'm male in this, but we're going to pretend and hope. Alright, and then we're going to come over here. We're going to have to go and, of course, fix ourselves up again, because that's how we roll. Alright, what are we looking at here? Bulletproof vests. Alright, how much? We don't have a lot of money. This stuff is pretty expensive. Alright, we're looking at 14, 13, 14 with a plus 4. I want that one. Alright, between all that, we should be fine now. Um, bulletproof vest. Okay. And Bella's got a common orb, and Butch has got nothing. They're only good with staves, I believe it is. Alright, so there we go. So yeah, if you guys want to throw random names at me, I'm not going to really put a list down and go bit by bit whoever was first. You know, the whole the whole nine yards there. But I will go, oh, that's kind of a cool name. I want to use that. And chances are, I don't know, I will skip a lot, even ones that I might think are cool. So don't feel offended or be upset that I don't choose the name. Just so you know. There's a new demon, new demon, there's a new demon named Voyas who's been gaining strength. Never heard of him. Probably no one important. Alright, so we're going to head up here now, and we're going to go and do murder. If you guys haven't checked it out yet, go check out Phantom Brave PC, my LP thereof, as that is the latest and greatest from NIS America, and it's right along the same lines as this game right here. So if you guys like what you see here, and you haven't checked that out yet, go do so. It seems to be a bit more popular than this one. I'm, I'm assuming because it's newer, but I'm not sure. All right, we're going to go hop into the Corridor of Love and see what that's all about. Anyway, what was happening, and it was very frustrating, anytime I would come to this screen where there's a battle, 
the game wouldn't minimize, but it would shoot down to like a third of the size of my screen in windowed mode, and you couldn't reset it back, and it would screw up the recording, because the recording would also shrink down to that size. So, bad Juju Magumbo is basically the long and short of it. Oh gosh. I don't think I'm a fan of how this is starting to look here. Alright, so what are we up against? We're up against a couple of archers. We're up against some sort of... I don't know. You're probably a warrior. You're probably... Are you a clair? You're a red mage. Okay. And a bunch of these dudes. What are they? Ghosts? Bogart. A bunch of Bogarts. Oh, this one's a different Bogart. What are you? You're, you are a ghost. Okay, so these must be upgraded ghosts. And these don't seem to do anything. Do we know where they exist? I guess not. Oh, it's on blue tiles. And the blue tiles are in the water. Okay, that makes sense. What do they do? 20 recovery to anybody on on a red tile. So does that mean I have to pick it up and then put it down? Hmm. Oh, no, no. Anyone on the tile, if I, if I destroy it, it will switch it to red. Okay, okay. I'm all over it. I know what's going on. I remember, guys, it's been a long time since I got to play. I wanted to play two or three more episodes before I left, and I did not get to, and it made me sad because the game was buggy and screwed up. It was not great. Alright, we're going to go there. I'm going to come out here. I'm going to make my move into the fray. Mm-hmm. Alright, and then we're going to get Etna out here. Or Bella, because that was totally who I selected. Absolutely who I selected. Um, and Etna. No, I, I really... I did accidentally select the wrong person there. My bad. Alright, so with all that, let's start throwing out some attacks. Uh, you have a special... You have ice powers. I'm just going to let you stay there. I'm going to have you attack now, Chuck... Then have you attack Ulrich, and let's see what happens here. Solo hit, here comes a tricore attack. One, two, and that's it. That was actually a little underwhelming. Oh, but we get to go with the double attack onto you. One, two, and still not enough. Well, I gotta say, I am underwhelmed. Alright, let's see what happens when we throw ice onto you. Literally nothing. Apparently they're immune to ice. Good to know. Alright, so next up we have our cleric. Which I suppose we can move down over here. Maybe defend. And we can get Vladimir out if we really wanted to. I suppose we get our printies out. There's no reason not to. Printies are fun, sometimes. Have you ever have you ever met an unfun printy? I haven't. All right, so we're gonna defend, and I think that's it. Let's end our turn and see what happens. All right, so they're gonna move up, smack the printy once. They're gonna double up onto me. They didn't do a whole lot, and then I got. I got uh, scratched for one as Lahar, or for zero as Laharl, who just like flat out owned the guy. So I mean, there's that. All right, we're gonna move Laharl over here because he's amazing, and we're gonna use our special. Huh? Enemies. All right, we're gonna use a powerful blow to hit him with rocks or something silly. All right, so we're gonna do that. I guess I will just try and kill you with things and stuff, and yeah, there we go. All right, let's execute, see what happens. That actually killed him? Okay. Bernie's going to bomb, we're going to hit. It's not nearly enough, but, however, good old Etna's there. I mean, we are level one, so obviously we are a little bit behind the times right now, but we'll catch up quickly enough, I think. 
I don't remember how strong Etna was. I think she was pretty strong, but I'm not sure. We'll see. All right, I'm going to move you, good sir, all the way down here. I'm going to move Butch, the uh, clearly male <clears throat> um, cleric, to go into position here yeah, and heal. I think the pretties are probably going to maybe, I don't know if I want to send them back or what I want to do with them. Oh, there are options that we can do with the printies. I mean, they are what they are. Kind of ridiculous. A little bit silly. Defend. We do have our Ice Mage still, and if we're not attacking the wrong things, that could be a good thing. And move our final printie down. And defend. Alright, well, let's hope this all works out. We'll find out soon enough. I don't want to quit. Here Execute. Goes. Throw the heal. Yay! Alright, and... Just end the turn? Alright, one of the printies just got wrecked. A little bit. A little bit of wreckitude. That's it, huh? Alright, we'll move down here. Move here. Move here. Look over here. And the attack is real. Follow-up attack is real. And the follow-up to the follow-up attack is real. Let's execute and see. The tricord of attacks. Not going to be super strong, but it's a little bit of uh, damage there. And then Laharl with a big hit. Not quite enough. Oh, but Etna bringing the pain, ladies and gentlemen. And now we're getting 40% of our health back each turn, which is fantastic. Alright, we're going to move here. And we're going to move, I guess, here. I'm never a fan of this whole situation, by the way. You guys are aware, but I really don't care for the whole side thing. I kind of wish you could pull them in from like a further apart deal, but that's okay. Alright, so we're going to do that. We're going to attack. And we're going to attack again. And we're going to execute. Ice Ice Baby. That was so pathetically weak. He did not pull from his friend. Here we go. Ready, dude? Here. Not as much damage as I was hoping. Alright, we did manage to pull him in though, so that's kind of neat. And we'll attack again. I don't think it's going to do anything, but you never know. Ah. Nope, not enough. Eh, still. It was alright. Ooh. Oh. Huh. That was way more painful and unsatisfying than I thought it was going to be. Alright, that being said, oh my gosh, it's awful. Nope, uh, sorry. It's alright, it's alright. Alright, execute, is this enough to finish you? No, it is not. Alright, we'll finish you now. See ya! Are you serious? Wow. Alright, well, that's not good. It's actually okay, but still. Meh. Alright, what can we do with you? Oh, cool, we can make it all the way up here. Nice. Like, I, I sort of want to go over there with him, but at the same time... I feel like it's probably a mistake. So we're going to try lifting, and then we're going to try throwing. I can't see the direction I'm throwing him. Ooh, I threw him a whole zero position spot things, because of reasons. 
Alright, well, I'm going to defend then, and then we're going to get her to move up and over here. And attack Wendy. And we'll attack as well. We'll execute. Oh, looks like we pulled some uh, love over. Nice. Now, the real question is... Oh, you really did move, huh? Turkey. You turkey monster. Is there anything else we can pull? Nope, that's it. Alright. We'll end our turn. We're going to lose someone else here. I think it's probably going to be the little dude down there. It's going to be me. I'm going to go down. It's got lit on fire. Now they're going to double up on me. Oh, they're going for Etna. Ooh, and they hurt her pretty badly. Okay, did not see that coming. I also didn't see... The Prinny's surviving this, which is weird. Alright, we'll execute a dis. Ready, dude! Boom! And done. Well done, Prinny's. Alright, you guys are retired for now. Alright, now I gotta figure out how exactly to advance this. Mm. I think the advancement's gonna have to be... Etna going up here and attacking you. And you moving down here and attacking Anastasia as well. We'll execute. A big hit and a definite kill. The definitive kill. Not bad. Alright, then we're going to move you back because, well, we need to. Let you defend and... You can probably chill right here. And why don't we get you to throw a heal up on our boy? We will end the turn. Way to go, Butch. Way to go. Alright, so Butch did what he do. They are not happy that Butch exists. They are going to try to stop him. It's not going to be enough. Butch says good day, sir. And so does uh, Laharl. Laharl well, seems less than uh, thrilled that bad Juju Magumbo is going on. We're going to use Boulder Crush here. We're going to use a special attack, I guess. Alright, let's, uh, let's see what happens. Big hit, follow up big hit, and yeah, kill and a level up. Sweet, that's exactly what we were hoping for too. Nope. Oh, I don't want to move there. Dang it. It's alright. Alright, we're going to move over here with you. No, we can't, we can't use the special right? The Impaler, it's not clear. Yeah, no, we can't do that. Alright, so we have to go with a regular attack. And then we'll have to move over just slightly. And special heal onto you. And hopefully, well, Butch is dead no matter what. There's nothing, there's no way we can survive with that. Alright, looks like we got an attack going there. Ah! I will, I will admit, the angles are kind of bad at times. It's okay, though. It's okay. Alright, execute. Big hit. Medium hit actually kind of small. There's a heal, which is definitely going down this time, but that's okay. And the choppity doppity da dop bop bop and down he goes, a level up. Ooh, no, he didn't. Wow, okay. Oh, that was just a retaliatory strike. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, he's going to go after Butch now. Yep, Butch is down. I told you guys. I knew. I knew what was going to happen. I could see the riding on the walls, ladies and gentlemen. Let's try Blazing Knuckle. I haven't tried that one yet. Let's give that a shot and see what it does. Okay, that looked really cool. I don't know how cool it actually is. Or Oh, gosh! Okay, did not expect it to also hurt her. That was a thing that I did not expect. Alright, let's attack Gowan and let's execute and see if we can't finish him with Etna's help. Big stab. 
zero damage onto Nick. Retaliatory strike, quite painful, very unsatisfying. But I believe we've got this no matter what. Yep, okay. So make sure I did it right. There it is, and victory is ours! So both of our clothy people did not survive this time around, unfortunately. 383 HL, and we got an Iron Lance once again. Alright, we're going to head back to our base camp here, and we're going to go and recover our folks, because they did not do well. Get treated, and by they, I basically mean I myself did not do well. Alright, yay! Ooh, we can claim another prize. What do we get this time? Muscle Brawn! What does that do? That is some sort of... Oh! Okay, it enhances our muscles. It gives me 12 HP. I am a fan. Alright, well, let's throw some... Let's rearrange. Manually. Um, I want to put you here. I want to put Bella there. And I want to put Butch at the bottom. Well, Harl should have enough oomph now to do something, too. To get ourselves... Um, Antros, or yeah, Antros onto uh, the field of battle. So we can look forward to that. Um, let's equip here. You know, you've got some stuff. I'm going to save the muscle brawn for a little bit later. Alright, let's go down here. Let's talk to you. I would like to start the, the assembly. Mahar, I'll create a new character. And Antro said he wanted to be a brawler, so we need 50. We're going to go with incompetent for now. I was hoping I could get a little bit further up the the line, but unfortunately that's just not in the cards. On Tro. And sign. No, there we go. Good old Antro, so we're going to give him one more to his attack as well. And he's going to be really good with punching people in the face with his hands and fists of doom. So we're going to come over here, weapon shop. Yes, I would like to buy. Alright, what are we looking at? we got a 10 attack there, a 12 attack, that's pretty epic. 13. And a plus to hit. Yeah, I'm going to go with the 13. Oh, we don't have enough? No, can we sell something? We sell some of the iron lances and the common spears, the common swords. And it's still there, right? A 13? Yeah, it is. Alright. Yeah, that gave us enough. Woohoo! Alright, very nice. Wow, there's a lot of stuff here. Like a ridiculously large amount. The scratch claw, huh? Can we try that on? It wouldn't be on to him. Would it go on to, like, Vladimir? Oh, he could totally use it. That's amazing. Well, I think I want to put it on Oleus. Alright, so that's what we're going to do. And that's that. Alright, so now we're going to go in here. We're going to equip... Yeah, we're going to equip, um... Oh, we got to rearrange again, sorry. Uh, manually. Antros needs to get... You know, we'll put him ahead of me. I'm fine with that, and I'll move up there, and we'll move you too. Alright, there we go. There we are. Alright, let's equip Antros here with his newfound, amazing, double slap glove of doom. And the muscle brawn. I actually wouldn't mind putting that on one of our mages, because our mages are, well, they have very little HP. Get treated. Alright. Well, ladies and gentlemen, before we break off the episode, or before I continue on, I'm going to break off the episode. See, I'm totally saying everything backwards. It's totally fine, guys. It's fine. Anyway, it feels good to be back. I definitely missed doing this with all of you guys, playing the games, doing the LPs, doing the YouTube stuff. I missed it quite a bit. I had access to a computer and I played some stuff on my own. It's just not the same. I enjoy sharing this with everybody and reading the comments and, you know, I just feel like I'm part of something bigger. And, you know, the channel's growing, so I'm enjoying life. Things are good. 
It's great. So I am really, really fired up and eager and excited to be back. And, uh, well, the next few weeks I'll be banging out as much as I can. And then, well, things will probably slow down again for a little while. But we'll see. We'll see what I can actually accomplish once things change. Anyway, until the very next episode, folks, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>